Okay, here's the box of what we're gonna try out today. It's called Liquid Stainless Steel Range and Dishwasher DIY Paint Kit. And here it says it has micro metal technology and you can use it to update metal, wood, and plastic. So here's the back. It says update appliances with brush on stainless steel. Transform your appliances in one day. And it says this is what the kit includes. So that's what we have here. It came with one can of the liquid stainless steel base coat and one can of the liquid stainless steel top coat in this foam brush. So, and here are the directions. It basically says to brush on thin layers of the base coat until you get your desired look and then you will top with the top coat. And it suggests using this. It actually says to use provided roller brush, which is odd because it did not come with one. And it looks kind of like they're using a squeegee here. Hmm. Okay. Well, it says step one, clean. Step two, roll on base coat. Step three, roll on clear protective coat. So I'm going to open this up and see what we're looking at. So hopefully the dishwasher will look like that. And in this picture, it says step one, clean, step two, brush on. Okay, this is the before of our dishwasher. If you're wondering, that is our fridge space. Um, we are getting a new fridge in the morning, so we took the old one out to the garage. But yeah, this is what it looks like. It's very basic. It's a KitchenAid um, dishwasher, and it actually works really well, and that's why we're going to try and paint it instead of replacing it for right now, um, just because it works. So... This is what we're going to try it out on, and I'm going to do it everywhere except right here. Um, it says you can get a static clean to go over your buttons so that you don't have to paint them. So I'm going to see if I can get that as well. Okay, got it all taped up. Um, I taped over all the controls, and I did find that film, and I ordered it on Amazon. So hopefully that will come in by the time I finish this. So let's get started on the first coat. Okay, so I wanted to show you what it looks like when you open it. It was crazy. I did shake it up, but I'm gonna stir it. Yeah, you can see all the metal mixing. But it, but it really just looks really sparkly. It's pretty cool. Okay, this is what it looks like after one really thin coat. It definitely is really um, stripey, but it even said in the directions and everything I read about this that that's what it's going to look like, especially on the first coat, and that it just kind of fills in with each coat. So let's hope that's true. But I can already kind of see how it's going to look pretty metal-like, which is nice. And um, this is a completely different material than up here, too, which is interesting. It's going to take a little bit differently, I think. Okay, this is it with all of its regular base coats. I mean, I think we're going to do, like, a little spot touch-up. Um, and I did get the film for the buttons. But, I mean, other than that, I think we're ready for the clear coat, or the top coat, but I mean, you can see this is next to our new fridge. Um, it doesn't look exactly, but like if you didn't know, I don't think you would even notice. It actually looks really good. I was a little bit skeptical while we were painting it, but it actually looks really great. And I mean, definitely good enough for the time being until we want to replace that, which, you know, we may do eventually. I'm going to do the microwave next. The stove... I'm going to think about depending on how the microwave goes, but that would be the next likely appliance we would replace. And that one would be a much bigger undertaking, so we'll see. Okay, so this is the final finished product on the dishwasher. And honestly, it looks really good, especially in person. For the dishwasher, you can't really tell. And I did put the film on the dishwasher buttons. So the only thing is, is that only works because they're dishwasher buttons. 
and you can kind of see them and you only have to hit one button. Um, for something like the microwave, that wouldn't work because you're not gonna be able to see the buttons. So we're not sure if maybe there's another film we can find. But overall, I think it turned out really great. Uh, for a $20 fix, it looks really good and it looks really good next to our new fridge. What do you think? Would you ever paint your appliances or is it too scary? <laughs> Um, I was a little worried, but I'm happy with how it came out.